Okay, it's after Christmas, so we have to remove the Christmas lights. That's what we're doing today. Oh, okay. And with that, Christmas is over. All gone. Best house on the block, no more. All right, dinner time. We're gonna be cooking again. This time we're using chicken breast instead of chicken wings. It's gonna be a quick one. To, to prepare chicken, you gotta brine it. And brining means soak it in salt water for 15 minutes. Now that I uh, cut the chicken, now I'll brine it. While the chicken is brining, we're going to make some breading for the chicken. The ingredients for the breading of the chicken is salt, garlic, paprika, cayenne peppers, black pepper, and panko breadcrumbs. Mix thoroughly and then prep the chicken. All right, the chicken has been brined, so I'll take it out and rinse and dry, and then uh, pat it with the breading. All right, so the uh, air fryer is preheated to 390 degrees, and you just throw them in there. It's been eight, seven minutes. Ooh, it just starts right up again. Perfect. That's disgusting. Tip for storing excess meat. Ideally, put them in their own baggies and then uh, seal, push out all the air. And to push out all the air, you just roll it. Roll it and then seal. If you don't have individual bags, you can seal them in one big bag. But to do that, you have to make sure they don't touch because if they touch, you get freezer burn. And boom. And you have freezer packed chicken. They won't touch so they don't freeze. Now you got vacuum sealed chicken. Perfect for the freezer. You can keep for a few weeks to a month and then. Uh, in the refrigerator, you keep for a few days. It finished cooking, and I need to use the thermometer to check the temperature. So stab the most thick part. All right, it should be finished. So then you grab this aluminum foil, and you just a little cover. Let it for like, like three minutes. Just let it sit, it'll cook to juicy tenderness. And then we'll try, we'll cut it open. It's pretty good. That's what I think is gonna happen. That's how you cut chicken. This is the fork. You, you already know. Oh. Hmm. Your chicken that good? Mine's pretty good. You see this? Oh. Oh, let it loose. Yeah. It does taste like KFC. Oh my god. Oh you my god. god. I'm exaggerate. I've done it again. It's okay. I've done it again. It's all right though. I've cooked the best chicken. It's right. so mine's, good. Mine's good. This is the way. Air fryer is so good. Yeah, air fryer, air, air fryer is the game. so good. The game. Oh my god. Just like it really does change the it's game. It's really salty, but it's it's pretty great. Look at that. Look at that chicken. Clean chicken with that crispy breading. Oh man, it's juicy too. It tastes like shake and bake um, chicken if you've ever had that or schnitzel. Schnitzel. It tastes pretty good. 
It doesn't taste like KFC, so don't expect it to taste like fried chicken. It tastes more like a breaded chicken. Yeah, highly would recommend. So good. So good. Kevin's saying no because he's like, God damn, it's too good. Oh man, chicken, chicken of God. Look at that cake. It's a fruit tart. Oh my God. Yummy, yummy.